wollte heute gerne erzählen, warum man äh, Konsumenten auch mit Inkasso glücklich machen kann. Und äh, ich werde heute ein bisschen switchen, äh, meinen Vortrag in Deutsch und in Englisch, äh, weil einige englische Zuhörer da sind. Welcome this morning. I'm going to switch a little bit between German and English, uh, even for the English speaking here to, uh, to listen my speech. And, uh, well, first of all, on that point, I would tell you a little bit about Laul. But uh, the best thing for the moment to tell you a little bit of uh, Laul is just look onto our website, laulgroup.de. Laul was hacked by a big cyber attack on the 18th of March. And that also meant for me all my data files are gone, and they are gone up to now also, seven weeks. And what's about my speech? And then I thought, well, um, why don't make me happy at least, and think about what me makes happy, and what do I need? Also, keine Dateien. Laul wurde gehackt und eben meine Präsentationsdaten waren auch weg. Deshalb habe ich mich gefragt, was macht mich denn glücklich? Und äh, was macht euch denn glücklich? Was mögt ihr am liebsten? What do you like most and what makes you happy? For me it's, uh, as you see, meal and uh, good eating, so a good dining. And, uh, well, currywurst, the German favorite, or some veggie, or some uh, old traditional cooking, or a stone cook, uh, star cooking, that makes me happy. But, was hat das mit Inkasso zu tun? What does it mean to debt collection? Let me tell you a little bit about that. Es geht um das richtige Rezept und die besten Zutaten. Und dazu bedarf es ja erstmal einem Basisrezept. You need a basic receipt and uh, therefore that's not my Bible. That's the basic and the basic means it's a cooking receipt book. Looks like a Bible, but that's what you might need. In Debt Collection, im Inkasso, sind es rechtliche Rahmenbedingungen, Fristen, Formen, alles, was es braucht als Basis. The basic you need in Debt Collection are the legal frameworks. You need to tell some formals, some uh, contact channels, all that's necessary to work uh, quite well. And you need some side dishes. Sie brauchen Beilagen. Und das können sein Portals, Ratenzahlungen, Installments, äh, Vergleiche, Settlements you need. You need some, in German, Belege, Nachweise, Documents that you need. And that are the side dishes for it. And at least there is a family secret. The spice mixture you need to make people happy with debt collection. And as you see, the debt collection landscape, for example, there are some big players like Lowell maybe is. You have the small and medium enterprises in that uh, branch and nowadays you have lots of fintechs. In the Inkasso landschaft braucht es die richtige Gewürzmischung, um am Ende ein gutes Produkt zu liefern, was den Konsumenten glücklich macht. But how do we make the consumer happy with our business? Where are you going? Supermarket, home shopping, what do you like most? Deliveries? Or you go just with a Uh, to the frit uh, fries at the corner down on the street and eat some. 
And that's where the receipt of the uh, market uh, participants come from. As you see, there are some big players and the small and medium enterprises. They have more of, I say, 2,000 years of experience. And that's also the Bible, what I normally tell, because in the Bible, our business is all already mentioned. There it's called Pharisee and Publicans. Unser Business gab es schon in der Bibel, da hießen sie noch Pharisäer und Zöllner, also mehr als 2000 Jahre Erfahrung. Auf der anderen Seite gibt es die Fintechs und Startup-Unternehmen mit viel Geschwindigkeit, mit erweiterten Zutatenlisten für das Business. You have the, the Fintechs uh, in that market nowadays. They are sometimes faster and um, have more ingredients, possibly. But what you see, let us take a small look onto, onto the fintechs. They want to uh, revo revo revolutionize uh, technology and the client's focus. And therefore, well, sometimes it's going with, uh, yeah, lost of know-how. Sometimes you have uh, data selection when you do it, and sometimes you're losing the round view on your business. And at least if you see on the definition about revolution, die Definition der Revolution heißt Umwälzung des bisher gültigen und bestehenden. Means in English the total change of what is valid and was valid and all the existing things. But uh, is it the right thing to look on a branch like a branch that exists for more than 2,000 years? You can compare, compare it to salt. Salt was a luxury good in former times. Nowadays, it's a standard. No one of you won't uh, uh, live without some salt in your, in your meal. So, at least let's look on one or two clients, uh, how they handle it, because when you go one step in front, even our clients are looking on their menu and what makes people happy. For example, Klana changing their demand strategy. Uh, no demand fees at least. That's quite new. Just a few weeks ago, they announced it. And uh, at least, but they, they still use different services and different uh, DCAs uh, to handle their well, bad uh, cases, probably. And on the other hand, you see Zalando. One other example, Zalando is also shareholder in a fintech DCA. On the other hand, they are also and still working together with uh, several DCAs and uh, other services. So they are made a mixture in their menu to make people at least happy to work with them. And so our branch, the DCA branch, is bringing up uh, new menus well, all the time with new information, new possibilities. You have additional services we are going to offer, everything to make at least consumers and also clients happy that it runs quite well. But at least the basic receipt is not new, it's always the same. And that's what, what takes consumers to debt collection. Was hat Konsumenten zum Inkasso gebracht? Übertragen in diese Welt zu scharf gegessen, too hot, too hot meal, they burned their tongue, they swallowed, probably, verschluckt, versalzen, too much salt, and therefore you need some, well, I guess you need Granny's old traditional remedies. And uh, so it, uh, 
it's just another name when you look on the German or on, on, on the world's cooking. Today it's uh, slow cooking, thermomix and, and low carb uh, to find something special. And for the debt collection branch, it's uh, very necessary to use personas today, a personas concept, where we are going to put people into categories. And as you see here, some example, like the chaotic, uh, cha chaotic upper class, the more chaos upper class, and um, how do they act and what do they need? And on the other hand, there are well, business people, what do they need? There are, well, multiple debtors, and you have that fraud and, uh, and other things. And people, they need some other, well, dishes or need some other menus to make them happy when they are going to be in contact with us. And if you see, that's a survey from, uh, from last year we have made, what do consumers like to have? And if you see the, the tops, uh, well, most of the debt, uh, debtors uh, getting in contact with the DCA uh, like to have um, a view onto their open amounts. Then they like to have several payment possibilities, how to pay. And uh, they want a rate calculator and some, well, maybe some, some informations about their uh, their risk profile, and some chat with the well, live chat with the, with our staff, for example. And if you that put it into the ingredients list, you may use several ingredients. So, if you see using PayPal today as a way to pay, even in the DCA, uh, it brings you up to 20% more cash than you have before. That is one nice ingredient we are going to use. And social media, yeah, that's necessary today because if you send out 100 emails, only 40 of them uh, were read and the other ones no one listened and no one is looking on to. So you need other ways to contact the people. Or you need to take this a, a kind of direct pay button. A direct pay button today brings you more than 10% cash. When the people are able, when the consumer is able to pay just with push the button here. And the other thing, chatbot. When you look onto, onto the e-commerce, there are, well, you can raise your uh, conversion rate two or three times, uh, three times with a, with a chatbot, but when you see before in our survey, the people like to talk in a live chat, so a live agent won't bring you up quite more than a similar, simple chatbot. At least it's the mix to make people happy, and the mix needs to talk to the people in the right way, in the right manner, that's what, what they like. Uh, where do, they, do you meet the people? What is the right menu? On what channel you're going to contact them? What payments do you offer to them? And you need, of course, some legal possibilities, legal enforcements, and uh, you need a long-term view because Many consumers are in our menu for quite a long time. And at least also the quantity uh, may an impact uh, on that business. And as you see, in the Lowell systems, there are around 25% of all the German-speaking consumers listed up to now with one negative information. 25% of all the German-speaking people are listed, or consumers are listed in our system. But that makes a difference. If you know a lot about people, you can do and go the right way and build up the best menu for them. 
And so at the end, let me tell you a little bit about the, the challenges that is uh, well in front of us. Uh, what's coming up and what will be influence our menu for the future. On one hand, we have the uh, regulation here in, in our market and you have a legal framework that is changing all the time. Then you have the data protection question. As you see, a lot of companies are hacked for the moment, not even we, also a lot of other companies like VIX, you might have read uh, this week. And you, you want to be secure, you need secure things. And the unemployment will be a big, big thing we are going to talk about and that needs to give new menus to the consumers in the future. I guess that will come up. And all the pandemic uh, things that came up in the last two years and on top nowadays the uh, well war in the Ukraine that will cause us trouble for many, many years, I guess, and will to bring to all of us uh, uh, a lot of uh, yeah, trouble and things we are going to handle. And at least uh, it's also that what a DCA, debt collection agency, has to handle. Yeah, so many thanks for listening and uh, Lowell, make credit work better for all. Many thanks.